The New York Police Department says there is a migrant crime wave in the city. And at the city's largest migrant shelter, a recent altercation between police and migrants was caught on camera. <laughs> In this video recorded from inside the shelter and posted to social media, migrants are seen throwing suitcases and large objects at officers. Seconds later, you can see a migrant on the ground surrounded by officers. Police say the migrant was resisting arrest. More items are seen being thrown. The migrant was asked to leave because the shelter said he wasn't supposed to be there and was fighting with a security guard. The struggle to apprehend the migrant continued for several minutes. Officers carried him out by arms and legs. More objects fly at NYPD before you see them rushing for the doors. The migrant was arrested, but prosecutors declined to move forward with the case, according to sources who spoke with the New York Post. This altercation between migrants and police happened last Thursday. If this is your first time hearing about this story, that's because it's not getting a lot of attention from the media. This graphic shows you what media outlets have reported on the migrants' arrest. You'll notice not a lot of news outlets are covering it. This is what we call a media miss by left-leaning news outlets. They largely left the story out of the news cycle, while outlets that did cover the story are largely right-leaning. This isn't an isolated event at the shelter on Randall's Island. There have been several other altercations leading to a permanent police presence at this facility. Since the start of the year, a migrant was stabbed to death by another migrant in the food line. Two weeks later, a security guard was stabbed in the neck but survived. 18 migrants were taken into custody following the incident. A migrant was arrested after fighting police while intoxicated, sending one officer to the hospital with injuries. While these are some of the incidents that have happened on the island, another altercation caught on camera in Times Square got national attention after migrants assaulted officers in the streets. While police warn of a rise in crime related to migrants, New York City Mayor Eric Adams says the majority of them are not part of the problem. Quote, the overwhelming majority of migrants in our care came to our city in search of a better life and the American dream. The small number of those disrupting that journey for the rest of the migrants in our care by acting violently will face enforcement to the fullest extent of the law.